open the gate. It's that drifter. Yeah, I know him. You feeling any better? What's up? Oh, hey. What do you mean? You got something to say about it? St. John, we got a job for you. Cope. You want Manny to work on your bike? Only one way that's gonna happen. I gotta do runs for you. Yeah, I heard you. I need you to deal with a marauder camp near those burned out shacks along the Cascade Highway. You know where I'm talking about? Yeah, I know it. Radio me if you want to know more. Hey, how's it going? How you doing? Hey. Hold on a second. I'll get Let's take a look around. Hope I'm heading to that drifter camp along the highway. What else can you tell me? Not much. They followed one of our supply runs. Got a little too close. I sent a man to check him out. He never came back. You sent anyone to find him? Yeah. A man named Deacon St. John. Cope out. You gotta take a closer look. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Gotcha. Can you use this? This is it. What do we got? <laughs> Still got this. Trouble breathing? Making it hard to talk? See if I can fix it! Ready to talk yet, huh? You dumbass! 
Why sacrifice yourself, huh? What's Copeland ever done for you? What's up? At last. No more! No more! Just uh, shut up. I'm cutting you loose. What? What? You're not... Copeland sent me. Come on, get up. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. They were following us on a supply run. I didn't know what to do. Hey, shut up. Can you run? What? Yeah? Yeah? Well, then run. Go. Thank you. I'll tell Copeland you saved my life. Here it is. Could make something out of this. Visitor's center. Gotta find a way inside.
fire escape. Down here. Not much left. This place has been picked over clean. Liston knife. This is it. Gotta get it back to Addy. I smell it. It's got to be getting close. Oh, I smell a nest. Got to be right here. That's the last nest. Should make it safer to ride through. Hey, open up! That drifter. Me and a couple of guys burned out in the nest a few weeks back. You know, freak your nest. A female came out. Hey. Oh. Here's that knife you were looking for. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem.
hide him here. Jesus, don't... Don't sneak up on me like that. Did you find anything out about Sarah, about the woman that I put on your chopper? Nothing. Nothing? Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. It's gonna take some time, okay? I'm risking my neck here. If anyone the, the back at HQ finds out, the, the, those guys with the guns over there, they'll all order the without same question. Team, O'Brien. Just looks that way. Look, I don't have time to explain it right now, but it's why I need your help. My help? D look, just take it. It's a, it's a wavelength recorder and some GPS trackers. I just need you to... T We're out of time. Look, I... Shit, I don't even know your name. Deacon, Deacon St. John. Well, look, Deacon St. John, if you want me to risk my neck helping you find whatever her name, uh, Sarah, then, yeah, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Let's go. Keep the radio close. I'll contact you in a couple of minutes. You don't even know my name? Oh, you're gonna know it before we're done, O'Brien. And keep the radio close. It's been right here the whole time, you son of a bitch. Jesus Christ, how long do I have to wait now? Hello? Are you there, Deacon? Yeah, I'm here. Now, what's this all about? What do you want? All right, I put a blocker on this channel. It's secure. What do you want? I've sent a series of coordinates to your radio. I need you to go to those locations. What? Why? Just listen to me. There are several Nero task groups doing work in the field. I need to know what they're doing. Then why don't you ask them? I can't. Look, I said it's a long story, and I don't have time to get into it right now. Let's just say the men above me, way above me, are running a lot of field missions, all separate from each other. Nobody knows what anyone else is doing. So the world ends, and you assholes carry on like nothing's changed. Where? I sent you the coordinates. Okay, Jesus, O'Brien. All right. I will see what I can do. Just get to as many of them as you can. There are active LZs, landing sites, sample drop-off locations. Yeah, yeah, I got it, but you better have something for me, O'Brien. Yeah, yeah, I got it too. Hold on. Chasing choppers down for you. The destination's classified. I'm locked out of their files. So I can't give you the coordinates to the LZ. You have to follow them in. Jesus, don't you guys have spy, spy satellites? Shit like that? that? Not that I have access to, no. I told you one. Locked out. Yeah, I heard you. Please don't lose them. O'Brien, they're landing. What do you want me to do? Each of these research units have a science guy, like me, guarded by a bunch of goons. I need you to get close to the researcher. The wavelength recorder is set to the channel for players to record data, to record everything they're doing. I right, see so you want me to sneak into an LZ filled with heavily armed Kevlar wearing soldiers who shoot on sites so that you can spy on some asshole wearing a po pocket protector? Pocket protector? Really? I'm a fucking PhD asshole. Stands for piled high and deep. Do you still have the tracking devices I gave you? Oh, I was gonna sell them, but most of us don't have access to shit like you know satellites. Place one of them on their helo. Almost all of these filed missions include stops that aren't on the books. I'm gonna find out where they're going next. 
O'Brien. You don't need to ask. I'm already looking to what records we have about where evacuees were taken. O'Brien out. Anyone else here then? This has got to be it. What the hell are you guys doing out here? still alive. They're not my boys. And what do you care? Aren't you a... What do you guys like to call yourselves? Drifters? Don't you kill them infected for money or whatever shit you barter with? Yeah, I kill freaks, but I don't carve them open while they're still alive and listen to them scream. Did you get my data? <laughs> yeah, I got your data. Okay, I'm uploading it now. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Brian? O'Brien! God damn it, he did it again. O'Brien, well, talk to me. Ah, shit, you better be in touch, O'Brien. Vagrant camp. Bastards have been ambushing all the supply runs around here, haven't you? Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. 
Don't believe the lies. Got him! Okay, one left. Here you are. That's it. You're done. How do you like that, huh? Being ambushed, you like that? You murdering sons of bitches. Bunker, yeah, I bet they had a bunker. Just gotta find it. Here it is. What do they got here? A map, yes. What do we got here? How to craft the... Okay, yeah, okay. Tough nesting zone. Oh, I gotta clear it out. I gotta cut down on the swarmers out here. There's another nest. Yeah, let's turn it up.
Where is it? God damn it. It's, it's gotta be... There we go. He's blown. Feels, yes. <laughs> now we're in business. I'll let you do it. Powers off, figures.
Should be it. Green lights, green lights are good. Green light, damn it. That's gonna bring them all down on me. They really better be something in here with us. Yes, Nero ejector.
Ooh, I smell a nest. Gotta be right here. Get in. Through here, yeah, this will do it. Inside here. his handwriting I want to forget <sighs> it sounds like something she would write yeah let's grab
is it? God damn, this has got to be close. Another nest. Burn it down. Gotta be right around here. Came by to see how the lazy bastard's doing. How you doing, mm. booze man? Are you are you tired of laying around yet, boozer? Hey, uh, you can't be in come here, on, Deacon. Come on, hey, come what's on, going Deacon. on? How's he doing? He needs his rest. Uh, don't mess around with me, Addy. I asked you, how is he doing? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, not good. Uh, damn, it's cold. The anti They're not enough. <laughs> Never enough. Oh, wait a second. You said that I, I said that we would try. <sighs> Look, all we can do is wait. Uh, wait. Okay. All right. Deacon. No, Deacon. there's. Uh, you Deacon. know what? There's something I can do Deacon. about Deacon. this. Stop. I can get. Stop! What? I know you want to smash something. I see that look yes. in your eyes. Well, you know what? You go right ahead, but you do it out there. Daddy, go. I can... Look. <sighs> there is nothing else you can do. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Please. Just go home. Go home, Deacon. Deacon, Deacon. So, you gonna make it? Yeah, Schizo, he'll be fine. I just, he needs a few days. Come with me to the lodge. I want to show you something. I got shit to do. I'm sticking my neck out here. Trust me, you're gonna want to see this. Just, just listen. 
couple of months back, this drifter comes into camp, telling all kind of crazy stories. Said he worked at the airport, was on the ground back in Farewell when shit went down. One night, they were expecting a flight in from Portland, only it never shows up. The plane was doing the haul for the Red Cross. The Red Cross? Yeah. You getting it? Medicine, doctor wow, shit, cargo shit. hold full of it. Maybe even some of those uh, anti uh, whatever the Damn fucks. Horde. Antibiotics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit like that. Like that Just like that. Where? Hey, like keep your voice down, will you? Let's talk inside. No. The mines are gone. So this drifter, he's working in the control tower when the plane disappears off the radar. Poof. Now you see it, now you don't. Right about here. South of Mount Washington. That's what he said. It came down intact. A controlled crash or whatever. The guys got to listen to the pilot bleeding out from a broken pelvis on the ground. Okay, so you haven't sent anyone to find this? Nope. Why not? Because the old man won't have it. Iron Mike, what's... Oh, right. Rippers. <laughs> you catch on quick. Everything west of the Iron Ridge here belongs to Carlos and his merry band of bald-headed freak alikes. Oh, shit. So you go over there and you get caught. You head north, brother. Otherwise, Iron Mike's treaty with rest and peace goes... Psh okay, no, no, like no, I get it, I get it. Let me ask you a question. Why are you telling me this? Oh, wait a minute. First off, I'm not telling you shit. You remember that? Second off, you're a goddamn drifter. What am I supposed to do? Follow you around like I'm your little bitch, keep your ass out of trouble? All right. I have things to do. I get it. You're just a regular stand-up guy, right, Schizo? Just trying to stay alive. Like everybody else. <sighs> hey. You do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, that's all we got. Do you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, Schizo. Keep your radio close. I'll be in touch. Schizo, it's St. John. I'm at the border. You see any of my men around? No, Schizo, it's clear. Look, how much time do I got? Time? Time for what? All I know is I got a card game going on with a few of my guys. A couple of them maybe they should be out on guard duty, but I'm letting that slide. If I had to guess, I'd say we'd be playing all night. 
So until morning, got it, Deacon out. Now.
Please will fix him up, and then we ride out of here, head north, like he said. Deacon St. John, you there? Deacon, this is Ricky. Over. Damn it, I can't let him know I'm out here. Uh, hey, Ricky, this is Deke. Uh, you're breaking up. I can't hear you. Deke, where are you? I need to get... Oh, God, sorry, Ricky. I don't have time for this right now. Gunshots, what's going on? We had a run in with a few rippers, but I handled it. You handled it? What is it? How? I should have known. That. You should have known what? Jesus, Ricky, who's running security here? You know, I ask myself that shit every single day. I'm done here. Good. So, what are you doing out here? What am I doing, Dick? Addie told me to come and get you. Why? What? Hold on for a second. Is Boozer okay? I don't know. We gotta go. What's wrong with Boozer? All I know is Addie told me to find you. When I asked around, I found out you and Skizzle were heading up here. Now I know why. I don't know what you're talking about. The crash site? The medical supplies? It's no big secret, Deke. Iron Mike was negotiating with Carlos, making a deal so our camp would split it with the Rippers. Oh, bullshit! What do you mean? I mean bullshit! I was there. Half that cargo hold's already been looted. Tracks from the crash site all head south. Now, I've been dealing with the fucking Rippers for months. You can't trust a goddamn thing they say. Now you're sounding like Schizo. Schizo, he put you up to this. He told you about the crash site. <laughs> yeah, great! So now you're calling me Schizo's errand boy. No? Then how'd you find out about it? A drifter up at Copeland's camp. Like you said, it ain't no big secret. Yeah, right. Well, Schizo's been trying to pick a fight with the Rippers for months. Guess it's lucky you came along to do it for him. So let me ask you something. Can I stop you? Last time I saw you, before last winter, you told Iron Mike to go fuck himself, because he wouldn't pay you to bring in survivors. That's not exactly what happened. I remember it pretty clearly. Iron Mike said he'd have nothing to do with slavers. Okay, we never forced anyone to come in against their will. How about Tucker? Same thing true for her? I don't know. You ever think when you roll up on someone, starving out in the shit maybe hasn't slept in days? reach the point where they stop running from men like you, you ever think they don't have a choice? But you took them to the hot springs just the same. Earn a few camp credits. Everybody's got a choice, Deacon. It takes us a lot, too, bringing in someone who can't work, can't earn their way. You know, you just be glad that Iron Mike isn't like you. William! William, if you can hear me, I need you to stop! Addy, what's going on? Boozer? <clears throat> Go and hold him. What the hell are you doing? Listen, what are you doing? Listen, do we need to do arm. this and we need to do this right now. You what? No! Uh, don't you... Oh, don't no. you take Deacon. it! No, no! De no, you're not... No way! No, you're not gonna Deacon, do this to him. listen to me! The antibiotics will save his life, but nothing on God's earth is gonna save the arm. Now listen, I need you to help me right now, or you can just watch your friend die. Okay. Eddie, we're losing him! Wait! Deacon. All right. All right, all right. Come on. Hey, pal. Hey, pal. 
All right, hey, I just uh, need you to stay hold with him. me. Hold him there. Okay. Hold him. Deke. Deke. Okay. Hold him down right there. Okay, okay, okay. Ah! Oh, my goodness. Ah! Losing. No, no, no. He's losing too much blood. You gotta stop. He's losing too much blood. Hand me the door. Oh! Oh, no. Loser, come on, man. Come on. Hold him. You're okay, pal. Where? Where do I hold him? Just hold him like this. Stop panicking. I'm and I'm crying. Hey, you did good in there. When I was in high school, I thought, hmm, maybe I should be a mechanical engineer, or should I be a surgeon? I guess I should have been a surgeon. <laughs> oh. And you. Hey, hey, okay. You know, you saved your friend's life today. I don't think he's gonna see it that way. Yeah, well, I think he will. I gotta go and give him his IV drip. And you know what, I don't know where you got all this, and I don't want to know, but it's gonna save a lot of lives, Deacon St. John. A lot of lives. I gotta go help Addie. Mike, just settle down, okay? Deacon, get out here! I heard what you did. I wasn't about to let him die. Mike, let it go. It's done. I know that, goddammit. Who's there gonna live? I don't know. But the Ripper saw you. Followed you back. When Carlos finds out about this, there's gonna be the devil to pay. Carlos can go fuck himself. You are writing checks with other men's blood. I hope you're good with that. You did what had to be done. Mike, wait up. <laughs> 